This is what 8,000 square feet of fun looks like to a kid. It's the Tulsa Children's Museum Discovery Lab, full of meaningful play for families with children 2 to 12. Yeah! We're in our main hall and where Tulsa Children's Museum designs and develops and builds all our own exhibits. So everything here is unique, unique to Tulsa, unique to Oklahoma. The mission here is to create an experience motivating kids to be active. Nearly everything featured in the main hall of Discovery Lab is made from repurposed items, just plain old ordinary materials. As ordinary as packing tape, we have the world's longest suspension bridge made entirely out of packing tape. And our 32-foot slide, which is, again, original to Discovery Lab. More than 14 miles of tape went into making the 10 bridges. We, we're just starting to refresh it for the third time, so about every uh, six months. And there's several layers of the packing tape, too. Yeah, it's not at, just... At each point, there's six layers of tape. Check out this two-story vertical climber made out of repurposed 55-gallon cardboard barrels. They're covered in recycled tires. It, I think of it as a human ant farm, but it's a, a vertical maze, so there's different paths through. <laughs> Watch the patterns of the pendulum, or make your own music with the lumophone. What's that, you ask? And these large aluminum cylinders are cut and tuned to a scale and then you, 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 you sound it by walking under the lights and, and interrupting the lights. That's some doorbell. Yeah. In fact, they use doorbell solenoids to strike. Vance Power says every visit for him and his son is a different experience. Things are always being added. It's changed a lot since the last time we've been in here. It's been like a month and a half since we've been in here at least, and everything's moved. Vance says this is inexpensive fun and gets him thinking. And it kind of gives you a few ideas about what you might be able to do with a little bit. I think it's amazing what you can do with basic stuff. I mean, nothing in here looks like it's like purchased from a store to do what it does. But it's all fun. He gets a kick out of it, that's for sure. This is the featured hall part of the facility where exhibits change out every so often. The day we visited, Red Dirt Dinos was in town. Just around the corner from here is the workshop. There's all sorts of projects kids work on in here, involving things like art, science, chemistry, and construction. They even have one of those really cool 3D printers. Each month there's a different theme and topic where children and families are given different materials and tools uh, to create, to innovate, and to have fun. Tatum's learned how to do electricity through Play-Doh and wires and Ma uh, puppets and stuff like that. Summer Nichols comes in here three times a week with her daughter. She has an annual family membership, which can make it a really great deal. Daily tickets are six bucks. Uh, like I said, I love the education aspect, the fact that we are in a safe environment where the kids can kind of run around and do their thing, spend their energy. Discovery Lab borrows from the best practices of children's museums across the country. Nonetheless, our experiences are unique, unique to Discovery Lab and unique to Oklahoma. Discovering Oklahoma at Tulsa's Discovery Lab, I'm Jason Grubbs.